Hello again, friends and fans. Raptor here, and welcome back to War Game European Escalation. Germany is again at war, and East Germany is invading. Here we go. All right, it looks like they're battling it out along the Autobahn. There could possibly be a uh, route of reinforcement here as we continue to fight it out with East Germany. It's 1975, so we'll be seeing units from the British and the Germans that are from that time period. The objective is to take and hold the Charlie sector on the plateau. British reconnaissances have engaged several East German units. They are trying to hold the Echo Crossroad. The 9th, 12th Royal Lancers Detachment has just lost its commander. We'll have to link up with them to take command. All right, let's do it. It looks like there's some British tanks in front of us, and then there's their defense at the crossroad, where apparently the intersection, or rather the overpass of the Autobahn, has been destroyed. Let's get our units moving out. We'll uh, bring one of the commands with us. If you want to read anything at any time, again, go ahead and press that pause button because there's a lot of information about how to use commands and whatnot. We'll be leaving a command back here so we can call out reinforcements. And let's go ahead and push forward with our uh, Flak Panzers and meet up with the British. Uh, link up with the 9th, 12th Royal Lancers is our first objective. It seems like we even have access to some American units and even more German tanks. Leopard 2A4s, or rather, Leopard 1A4s are with us here. So that might be a good unit to call out. Let's call out uh, four of those. Definitely good to have some tanks out on the field to deal with anything that the East Germans may have. Also some recon units. Uh, looks like we have access to a Luke's. Uh, let's see what else we might have. Support some anti-aircraft units. Let's call up... Actually, we might see some enemy aircraft, so let's deal with that. Again, if they call out anything, it'll probably be in the form of a helicopter. So we'll have to watch out for any sort of uh, East German helicopters, possibly Soviet support. We don't know. But anyway, we're going to push forward. We've linked up successfully with the British. Okay, let's go ahead and start scouting forward. Uh, let's see. Uh, we're going to continue to push forward and uh, bring our tanks up, too. Looks like we've got chieftain tanks that can move up. They're closer, so go for it. And let's hide that command. Uh, let's see. Deploy a command group at the Echo Crossroads. Roger that. Let's bring our uh, flak panzers up. We'll keep those on the road. Where's that other flak panzer? Oh, good. Everything's coming up now. Very nice. All right. No sight of the Germans so far. No East German units have been spotted. We're pushing up on that. Uh, file. Wait a minute. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, we, oh, okay. We got enemy attack choppers. Oh, great. That's the last thing I actually wanted to see. Uh, that's uh, MI-24s with... Uh, oh, boy. They got rockets. Oh, that's not great. ATGMs are being fired from those... Wow, almost hitting one of our vehicles. Stunned and gunned. Oh, excellent. One of the tanks, British tanks, there shot down one of the choppers. Oh, they're going crazy. East Germans are losing control of their choppers. Only recon made it through. Watch it, boys. Wow, a helicopter crashed next to the highway. Good job. All right, we were able to successfully knock one of those choppers out of the sky. And it looks, oh, we're getting attacked from the flank. T-34 is from the flank. All right, let's uh, approach the British up here. Let's link up with them before they uh, get destroyed. And let's get British tanks into the tree line here to deal with T-34s. Go, boys. Let's bring up our German tanks, too. Actually, let's bring the uh, Flak Panzer. Okay. Got another one of those. Leo 1A4s. Let's push those forward. T-55s. Enemy T-55s have been spotted. Keep moving. Oh, let's get the hell out of here. All right, let's get the Germans out of here. Or the British out of here. Let's link up with the Germans. Damn, they're attacking us from up here. All right, we got a British tank that's actually routing. There's so many German tanks here. We're asking our units to just pull out of there. Retreat, retreat, retreat. There's just too many tanks. Those T-55s can't hit a damn thing. All right, T-34-85s being decimated in the field now by German tanks. British tanks need a little little breath. They've uh, been engaged for a little while. T-55s are approaching up here, so we got to get those up this direction now. Okay, Scorpions are... Oh, wow, they're taking a lot of fire. Pull it back, boys. Let's get the British infantry out of here. British tank there's routing. Damn it, there's no time for retreat, boys. Stay on the line. All right, now we've, we're just attacked from the west. Look at the amount of uh, tanks we've destroyed there. Now the uh, East Germans attacking from the northeast and northwest. Coming through the overpass now. There's a lot of tanks coming our way. Let's get these Saracen all the way back to the Jupiter supply truck. 
Wow, we, wow, how the hell is all, all this fire here? Is that from the rock? That must be from the rockets we dealt with earlier. Wow, look at all that fire. All right, the chieftains can t definitely take a hit. Yeah, they can. Of all the tanks, they're probably the most survivable right now. And look at that. There's a slicing through T-55s. Good job. Scorpion tanks are keeping them under fire. Chieftain here, engaging on the western side. All right, let's flank them on the left now. Let's bring up the British armor. Keep going. All right, British infantry just chilling in the back for now. All right, let's bring up a Kurs. Let's keep recon going. Again, remember to read the top of the screen, too, to see all the things deploying. You can see what's going on in the in the world outside the battlefield where uh, there's an emergency meeting at the UN, that type of thing. All right, looks like one of our tanks has been pretty hit there. Let's push up and see if we can recapture that forward operating base. All right, there's a Flampanzer remaining. And a uh, T-55. Good thing we didn't drop our infantry there. If we would have defended in that position, we would have been crushed by all those flame tanks. The East Germans had a hell of a lot of troops. Holy crap. All right, uh, let's see. Well, let's resupply then. Let's get that uh, Jupiter supply truck up here. Everyone else, go ahead and take, take a seat here quickly. Let's repair. Oh, you're routing now? Why would you route now? All right, well, let's get everyone under the umbrella, the defense of the uh, FOB, or at least the resupply. Everyone get up here on the highway. Let's get ready to follow through with our attack. Chieftain, go ahead and proceed here. Kurs, proceed to cover at the uh, tree line there, or the bushes. All right, we got a city over here. We've got the city of uh, Noirm Buchen. And uh, I don't know, I think these are real-life locations that they've uh, taken satellite images from. You can see the overpass there destroyed by... Uh, Enemy forces. Tank here still routing. This is the most annoying thing of this game, and they changed it for future games. This Flak Panzer is actually capable. I've driven one of these before. Actually, this is something that I've uh, driven in real life, and it is, boy, does it handle nicely. Crush cars with it, too. You can check my Instagram down below, too, to see me behind the wheel of that one. It's very nice. Too bad I didn't get to shoot the guns, but that is one that can cap It's capable of destroying T-55s and T-34s. It can do it. All right, let's see what we got for ammunition. 35 out of 40. All right, let's go ahead and resupply. All right, we're gaining some more points. In order to gain the advantage in the enemy, we should probably call out more recon, although uh, tanks are probably going to be the most important thing here. We need to cut through uh, the vast amount of enemy uh, tanks. We're going to wait until we can call out two. We're going to need about 90 points for that. I'd rather have some more German tanks here at our disposal. All right, let's push forward with... Uh, what do we have for infantry? Where did the British infantry go? And let's get that command up here, too. We now need to uh, deploy command at the Echo Crossroad now that we've kind of captured it. Let's get recon up here. Where's the British recon, though? Uh, what? I don't know what my hotkey is for unload any longer. So let's go ahead and do it the old-fashioned way. All right, looks like the infantry are resupplying, too. Good. Ah, they're green jackets, which mean they're recon units. Fantastic. All right, let's bring up some recon, then. Wow, the Germans just pushed us back, but we decimated them underneath. That was a cool battle, seeing them come under the overpass. And, uh, boy, they could have won there. They almost won that one. If it weren't for the British tanks. They could have got our German tanks, but we were well spread out. All right, before we advance, we're going to make sure the area is secure. And we've been asked to uh, deploy a command at the Echo Crossroad. We have to keep our other command back at Lima. It looks like the enemy's getting reinforcements from Foxtrot, so they're coming in from the west as well. Or at least I'm assuming that's the west. We might be able to go up and attack that area, but we're not ordered to do so yet, so let's just stay put. Let's hide our units then. And try to spread out a little bit. Hard to do so around the FOB, but... Okay, looks like we're securing this area now. Green Jackets haven't found anything out of the ordinary. Can you... Is this a... That should be an area they can take cover in. All right, let's get a command up here. We're clear to advance. Get some Saracens up here. These are nice. They're basically a British troop transport. All right, let's advance then to the clearing. Oh, man, I hope we can do it. Okay, eight minutes in, we haven't taken any losses. We're lucky so far. Uh, the Royal Lancers have yet to get a kill in, it seems, but they've done a good job of at least staying alive. Another enemy fob spotted up at the uh, next intersection. Looks like yet another bridge destroyed by the East Germans. They've been ordered probably to uh, stop some of our movements in the area by disrupting uh, infrastructure. Uh-oh, pull back. Whatever that is, I don't want I don't want it. Nope. 
Okay, we've definitely seen some enemy units here. All right, over. All right, let's get a little breathing room. All right, our next objective is complete. Sweep Charlie Plateau, which is on to our right. Well, that's kind of where we just were. Uh, retain control of Echo Crossroads with command units. All right, so they may counterattack again. Uh, we can now get some additional tanks up here, more skilled ones. Let's do that. And I don't think we can call on the British for any units, can we? Oh, it looks like it's going to be Jaegers, if anything, uh, which are armed with law rocket launchers. 15-point units each. We may as well try to call up some German infantry now. They will be able to uh, sweep this area very nicely. Let's have the Green Jackets sneak up here. Then we're going to go into this large forest. All right, let's set up a perimeter. Let's keep our uh, Green Jackets close to us just in case there's infantry. We'll have the mechanized units move out. All right, let's set up a perimeter around our FOB. Engaging enemy tanks. Looks like uh, enemy light recon. Oh, actually, there's T-34s approaching. All right, get, get the German tanks up here. We'll guard the high, highway. And it looks like they're hitting us in the flank. Wow, bad, bad day for them. You should have not come anywhere near that corner. All right, Green Jackets have got to successfully make it up here. Taking a few losses, open up on them. They were in cover, but they spotted them. T-55s are counterattacking. Yep, from every direction. All right, Kurs, get back here. We don't have any tanks over there. Chieftains, get ready to engage. Damn, they're coming down the road. They're actually attacking again. Well, let's get some more infantry up. I want to get some of our infantry into our tree lines. Oh, nice. Green Jackets versus Motor Shoots, and the Green Jackets are going to win that one. Enemy cell, um, recon there. Oh, my God, there's so much going on. All right, Chieftains, engage that tank. Wow, look at all the movement from the enemy. All right, let's get the Leos up here now. Change of plans. We're constantly adapting to uh, the enemy's movements. Incredible. All right, that command or that uh, recon successfully pulled back. Green Jackets are opening up with ATGMs, or uh, rather rocket launchers. Oh, nice! The East Germans decided to go into the woods and are getting decimated by the M72 and also uh, firing back at the British forces. But not before the British have uh, panicked the hell out of that vehicle. Oh, ATGMs! Maliukas! Open up on that damn thing. All right, pull back with the British. Destroy those Maliukas. Oh, we got to pull out with the tanks. It's too much. German tank destroyed there. It's way too much fire on that peninsula. We got to get in there and cut them out. All right, pull back to the fob. Those boys have to retreat. Wow, look at the amount of <laughs> the shaking of the screen. It's an intense battle going on. Oh, we're getting attacked from behind again, too. T-62 is coming up from behind. That explains where some of our troops went. Another wave of transports coming in. Oh, we got to secure our uh, FOB. All right, another German tank eliminated there. Dear God. Looks like that uh, British green jacket didn't make it out. Wow, they're actually counterattacking in all directions. This is incredible. Some of our units are routing. Leper 1A4s. We've only lost one of them so far. Those T-62s have got to go. Moat shoots that are coming through. Excellent. The Gepard there to destroy them. Go, Jaeger. Shoot it out with them. Here comes the rest of our Jaeger troops now. I'll split these and get these operational. God, what a mess. Excellent counterattacks from the enemy so far. It's been really exciting. This is more than what you see in a typical uh, war game, Red Dragon game. Usually the AI is pathetically dumb. But here they're seemingly capable. T-62s are still hitting us from here. Those units are only panicked. Luckily we have our units sitting down here. All right, let's get more uh, supply up here. All right, let's get the German infantry up here. 
Unfortunately, we lost our British recon. They went in deep, but damn, did they do some heavy hits on the enemy. They ambushed them in the woods and got rid of some of those tanks, too. Hats off to them. There could be that Maliuka still here, too. Right, let's push up to this tree line. Wow, T-62 is not even taking a damn hit, but hitting our tanks. There we go. Let's get some damn kills on these T-62s. I expected them to die by now. There we go. We have uh, two, four, six, seven, eight. There we go. West German tanks finally pushing them back. Dear God. Keep an eye at the top of the screen, too, by the way. I will heart your comment if you take the time uh, to go back and read every one of those messages and type them out and timestamp them so people know what's going on. For example, Royal Air Force takes control of Hanover Airspace, that type of thing. All right, well, we were tasked with controlling the uh, plateau up here, but, man, the uh, East Germans really had a heavy counterattack there, taking out one of our tanks and a couple of infantry squads. Well, we're faring better than they are, though. They've lost tons of T-34s and lots of infantry, too. All right, let's uh, reach out a little bit more, do some more recon here. Let's get another recon unit up to watch our flank. I think the Kurs is probably our best thing to call up for this. I'm going to call out one of those. All right, we have a malfunction here. Let's get the tanks back to uh, fully rearm. Let's have a chieftain up on the line. Where's that other chieftain, by the way? We have a chieftain here, chieftain there. Did we lose a chieftain? We should have three. There it is. There's the other one. Now right, we're closing out on where those Maliukas were. They did an incredible amount of damage. Close range. We weren't able to hit them. Ah, there's the enemy's uh, command. Okay, we can close in on that with our German infantry now. We still need to eliminate those tanks. Not so much for that. Enemy tank spotted. Ooh, those are actually T-72Gs. All right, that's a tank we haven't encountered before. Taking that group out, we'll have to take that uh, tank down with a lot of force. We'll wait for our, we'll wait for our recon to get here, and then we're going to cross this way. We're going to go up that way and deal with them that way. Let's block them up here for now. Damn, those T-72s. Good. Well, we actually have a decent battle on our hands. I'm welcoming that with open arms. All right, let's bring up some more tanks. And we'll get those trucks ready for that line, and let's bring up some for the troops over here. All right, well, we'll defend the uh, the roadway while we take out yep, T-62s. Very nice. Still getting hit in the flank. That other one coming back. All right, let's speed our way up here. This vehicle can't take any cover in here? Well, it can take cover here, but not, not here in these much larger trees. Okay. I guess that makes sense. Enemy uh, killing 125 points worth of our troops. Mostly that British infantry, that recon infantry that was MVP. They did a fantastic job. Uh, we're going to have to push our way further down the line soon enough. So this is going to take a little bit of time to creep through as we are combing through the enemy defenses. Right, let's get ready to climb that mountain. All right, additional German tanks are on the way. Very good. I think we'll send them all the way up here to the north. This is a, primarily a German battle. We can't rely solely on the British. Let's get additional vehicles over here. Uh, recon or whatnot. I mean, uh, supply over here. Okay, it looks like our tanks are good to go. Right, let's bring up the tanks. There's nowhere for us to have cover there. So that sucks, but let's move up this way. Kurs, go ahead and move across the field. Bring up a uh, motorized Lukes now, so we can get up here faster. Looks like we're resupplying everyone. Jupiter out of ammunition again. And the FOB almost out too. We'll have to capture that second one. All right, we're almost ready to launch the attack then on the East German position at Charlie, the Charlie Plateau. Could still be attacked from multiple positions, so we're just watching out for that. All right, spread out our tanks. All right, so there's T-72s here. So let's split this Jaeger group. Bring two of the squads back. 
We're going to go into that tree line to the north. See if we can use that. Okay. I think we've got ourselves a plan. All right. We've created a wall of West German steel here. I'm going to try to go right now. We should be able to bring the armor up this way. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to hit them from the flank here, hit them directly, and flank them all at the same time. Those uh, T-72s are very deadly tanks, very capable of destroying what we've got here. So I don't want to I don't want to engage them for too long or at all, if if not necessary. All right, we're going to call out some more tanks. Oh, what the hell was that? Just destroyed something big over there. Oh, it's the uh, Kilo Point. Enemy won't be receiving reinforcements from there any longer. Oh, we have a secondary objective to... Uh, Take control of the enemy reinforcement sector over there. Okay, we do have a new objective then. Let's get the uh, Lukes that we just captured ready to do this. Okay, let's go in there. Just need to get our infantry in there. All right, well, while we're waiting, let's bring the green jackets over then. And the Lukes. And our new tanks. We'll meet up with them and start an attack then on this secondary objective. Okay. Meanwhile, we are ready to start over here on our attack. All right. There we go. Okay. So as soon as we're spotted, the fight's going to begin. T-72 needs to be dealt with right away. Okay, Jaegers are spreading out. 20 men there to clear the forest. Okay, this is going to be a big moment. No enemy uh, tanks have been spotted. Let's move up over here. Oh, vehicle has been detracked there for a brief moment. Okay, we're going to have to stop our assault until that's ready. We need all of the tanks on the line to destroy those T-72s with minimal losses. Okay, well, we're going to see what the enemy has here in just a moment with our green jackets. Perhaps we could actually keep them over here. And sneak over this side. Make sure the uh, flank of those green jackets are secure. Friendly tanks are arriving now. The Leos are here. Let's get a scorpion up here to work with them. Here, a firefight somewhere. Here. All right, we'll push our forces back. All right, immense concentration now on taking control of the Foxtrot sector. All right, I think we're good to take that sector. Okay, let's go ahead and begin then. We'll uh, try to see what we have with the Kurs. And then we're going to get ready to attack that tank. All right, let's close range with them. So we can spot those T-72s quickly. Enemy FOB. Uh, command vehicle destroyed. FOB now capturable. Meanwhile, on the left flank, we'll push forward. There we go. T-72s hitting us. Look at that. The amount of tanks engaging those T-72s. Leopard 183s are hit. Look at that. One tank remaining, having to be ambushed by multiple tanks to conserve our forces. Wow. Good job, boys. And that's the end of our uh, supply there. All right, we're moving our forces up now. We have to eliminate that. Yeah. What, that's the end of the objective? Oh, was that the end of the... W oh, we beat the mission. Oh, d well... <laughs> All right, well, given one more second, I would have eliminated that reinforcement point. It said to take control of the Foxtrot reinforcement sector, but you saw me already working on it. We uh, we cut left, and we're destroying that command unit. So we'll just call that a total victory there, as we pretty much had done that. We just, I guess, a, sh a lucky shell didn't hit. But check that out. All the forces destroyed, and uh, 
You can see our losses, too, mostly of green jackets and a couple of transports when we brought up that thing, plus the Maliuka hitting one of our tanks. But a good job so far. All right, I'll see you in the next battle then for more uh, War Game European Escalation. Thank you, everyone, for clicking and tapping that like button, and I'll see you in the next one. And uh, hopefully we can continue on getting all the stars we need and completing all secondary objectives. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Thanks for leaving a like. Thanks for subscribing. And I'll see you next time. Bye, everyone.